to my channel. Today, I want to talk about the evolution of Lamborghini Diablo. The Lamborghini Diablo is a high-performance mid-dancing sports car that was built by Italian automotive manufacturer Lamborghini. So let's talk about it. The Lamborghini Diablo was built to replace the Countach. The car was presented to the public for sale on the 21st of January 1990. The vehicle could reach 0 to 62 miles per hour in about 4.5 seconds and a top speed of 202 miles per hour. Introduced at the 1992 Geneva Motor Show, the Diablo Roadster concept showcased what a possible open-top version of the car would look like. That's crazy! The VT was the second generation Diablo. Three years after the first one appeared on the market, it had an improved power steering system, all-wheel drive, resized front wheels. The car was able to reach 62 miles per hour in 4 seconds and a maximum speed of 208 miles per hour. The Diablo SC30 was introduced in 1993 as a limited production special model to commemorate the company's 30th anniversary. A year after Lamborghini's 30th anniversary, a second special edition car came out, the SC30 Holder, which was slightly different from the original SC30. Only 150 SC30 models were built, and of this, about 15 were converted to Holder specification. The Diablo SV was introduced in 1995 but the Geneva Motor Show, reviving the Super Veloce title, first used on the Mura SV. The SV is based on the standard Diablo and Nurse Lux, the four-wheel drive system of the VT. Unveiled at the 1996 Geneva Motor Show, the Diablo SVR is the lightweight competition version of the SV and the first Lamborghini to be officially built for motorsport purposes. In total, 21 examples of the SVR were produced Following the first steps of Porsche in 1996 with the ZT1, a purpose-built racing car that created the story in motorsports, only two cars were built. One was meant for racing and one was the road legal version. The Diablo received the mid-cycle facelift in 1999. The power output of the engine was increased to 529 horsepower and 446 pound feet of torque. The Lamborghini Diablo GTR introduced at the 1999 Bologna Motor Show. At the end of the Diablo's production run, the company introduced the limited production Diablo VT 6.0 SE. This model was only available in two colors. We have just seen the evolution of Lamborghini Diablo model. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Have a nice day and see you next time.